Officer Matthews, I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. I'm gonna need backup. Copy that. All backup Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. Could you have any less game? <sighs> I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> oh my god, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Okay, just don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. Would be awesome to see you there? What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Well, the suspense is killing me. It's dad, he wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a 10 year old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen saying she can't wait to see us at the party. What? Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So, so what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself. Man. 
We need to find a couch for your yard one day. Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you wanna hit or not? Yeah, okay. It's Friday. Thanks for making me smoke again. Oh, then I'll make sure you don't smoke any weed tonight. Deal? <sighs> Deal. <laughs> Can't wait to see you baked as hell trying to pull this off. <sighs> Speaking of weed, I got that covered tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. Hey, whoa! What the hell are don't you doing? Don't move! You're my human post-it note. First, we need money for supplies. Munchies, chips, and dip, soda, etc. Uh, this better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. I can probably snag a six-pack from Dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? Hmm. Oh, right. Blankets. It's gonna get so chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C-O-N-D-O... Oh, stop. You're out of room, punk. Whoa, good drawing, Lila. Daniel's teacher would be proud of you. Ha! The pretentious artist has spoken. Don't fall asleep before me tonight, or you might see more of my skills. <laughs> you wish. <sighs> These fucking planes, man. I want to hate them, but I'll miss them so much if I move somewhere else. Shit changes so fast. I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Will you still be my BFF? Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? Yeah, man. Friends forever. Yeah, but what happens if we go to different colleges? Or you get sick of me? Whatever. Uh, you heard of the internet? <laughs> No way distance can tear us apart. We're freaking fighters. Yeah, you're right. Best freaking fighters forever. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Hello, Friday night. Hey, perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh, sure, but I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said- Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. I feel really supported right now. You're welcome. And now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <gasps> really? Hey! No fair. Court is in session. Judge Diaz presiding over the case of the last Choco Crisp. I... I have to go, uh, get ready for a party and stuff. So... Well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, you have to earn it, Your Honor. Oh, shit. Hey, he swore. Yes, I heard Tattletale. Hmm. 
please, Judge Diaz, be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco crisp? Your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week or your poor suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage? Me, me, me. Come on, Judge. Shh, 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 shh. Let him decide. Judge, the verdict, please. Daniel was guilty of being a brat, so the Choco Crisp goes to Senor Diaz. What? No way. You're a cheat. <laughs> nope. I'm the law. Your Honor, I can't let you punish an innocent man. So? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I always knew you'd confess. Okay, back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. And you better play nice together, like you always do. I have to go to work in my room, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Don't hurry back. <sighs> okay. Let's get this part. started. This will work. I don't want to get wasted in front of Jen. Okay. Better take that instead. Cross that off the list. Drinks down, food to go. <sighs> no way. Dad will kill me if I take his precious candy. You're coming with me. Maybe this is better. What the? Is Dad baking something? Lila's so hyped up for tonight. Real funny, Dad. Yo, Dad's secret recipe fucking rules, actually. Very funny, Lila. Asshole. Very funny, Lila. 
Good thing my boss has a sense of humor. Kind of. Man, I so don't want to work this weekend. <laughs> that would be sick to just go tag the world. All right, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? I'm broke, so I better find some cash for tonight. Bet you, Sean? Yeah. Yeah. Don't get too excited, kid. You're making me nervous. Hey, since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Sure. Can do. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, uh, shoot. Must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. Jeez. That was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on. Sam came by the garage today. Told me to tell you hi for him. How's this leg? Well, you know, old fossils like us don't heal the way you do. Ugh. Remind me never to get old. Hey, it beats the alternative. Hey, I got it. I think. Hmm. Wrong size. I need a 16 millimeter. Hey, did you get your English midterm back? Uh, yeah. I got a B. A B? But you were so confident about the essay you wrote. Yeah, I think Mrs. Callow is just prejudiced against Vonnegut. But Slaughterhouse-Five is amazing. Hey, you don't got to tell me. Tell her. Next parent-teacher meeting? <laughs> She's getting a piece of my mind. Pfft. Prejudice against Vonnegut. <sighs> hey, seriously. What's taking you so long? Hey, seriously. I'm not a mechanic. Come on. Bring me anything, really. I'll tell you if it's the right one. Here you go. Nah. I need one with the black switch on it, so I can change its direction. Hey, I got it. I think. Mmm, it should have a flex head. I can't reach that bolt otherwise. Okay, hey, forget it. I'll do it with this one right here. It'll probably work. Ah, oh, shit! All right, never mind enough of this. I'm done. Hey, quick tip, my son. Go Google wrenches and see what you can learn. Yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing. But you gotta learn a trade. Art, athletics, engineering, I don't care. 
as long as you put your heart into it. You always say that, but for what? <laughs> so you deadbeats can take care of me when I retire. <laughs> You'll never retire. Someday, then maybe back to Mexico. Back to Puerto Lobos. Ugh, oh, I've heard this one before. Mmm. I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Well, you don't have to. I mean, it's cool. Are you sure you're my son? You don't want to visit Mexico. Don't want to have a car. I can't even get you into Rush or Santana. Are you going to ride the bus for all your dates? Like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock blocking me the whole time. He's nine. He doesn't even know what cock blocking is. He looks up to you, Jean. Try and help him. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um, by the way. Ha. I was wondering how long it'd take. You need money for the party tonight, right? Ah, 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 shh. Just be honest with me. No bullshit. Are you using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? Uh, come on. I, I wouldn't spend money on booze. We just want to get some, uh, some Halloween crap and stuff. Well, then you definitely don't need the $40 I was going to give you. Twenty bucks? That's it? You can buy a lot of Halloween crap and stuff for twenty bucks. Unless you're lying your ass off. Remember, no eating candy and driving. You got it? Tell Lila too. You hear me? Yes, sir. Yeesh. Just be careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. When you were my age, be a lot. <laughs> Sorry. What happens in Mexico stays in Mexico. Now I changed my mind about that cash. Keep an eye on Daniel while you're home, would you? All right. Thanks, Dad. Hey, not so shiny boy. Look, your papito dessert. <sighs> okay, but not too much. I won't. Promise. Bye. Love ya. Love you too, hijo. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenage, even though he won't tell. Daniel destroyed our old nativity scene. Sorry, baby Jesus. How long is he gonna keep all this shit? Gotta get that love blanket. Even if I don't hook up with Jen, well, it's not my turn to do the laundry.
Lila provides the weed tonight. I better be ready. Dad wants me to keep this junk as backup. Right. <sighs> Not sure Daniel was ready to be an uncle yet. Dad said we could go to Mount Baker this year. The trails are insane. How long is he gonna keep all this shit? Dad should just sell that other bike. There must be some blankets in the laundry room. Can't believe Dad actually asked me to tag up this wall. Well, of course. He asked Daniel too. I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. Looks like I got everything. Better pack it all up. Finally, ready to go. Time to Skype Lila on my laptop. Lower boy, just give me a minute. Gee, where did I put the... Mm, hold on. <laughs> okay, hi. Did you get everything on your hand list? It's all in my backpack, yeah. Dad hooked me up with some cash, so we're set for the night, in case we need anything else. Or if you and Jen need anything else. Ooh la la. <sighs> okay, serious talk. What are you gonna say to Jen tonight? I don't know. Whatever. Do I need to practice? I've seen you in action. Yes. You're totally into her, right? Duh. Why do you think I'm freaking out? She's so super cool. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean. into you. Sean! I'm done, look! I made zombie blood. It's, um... 
corn syrup, and food coloring. Hey, hi, <sighs> Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just... Come on, man. Just the... Just bugging the uh, shit out what? of me again after I told you to knock? Uh, yeah, what? I know. <sighs> anyway. Sean, you're an asshole. What's your problem? <gasps> but... I want to see zombie blood if you don't. Sorry, sorry. I'll make it up to him. He knows I can be a dick. I'm just stressed out about tonight. No, oh, please. We're gonna have so much fun. Maybe tonight's the night... Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. This time, don't get caught. Hey, are you listening to me? Um, you know something called multitasking? <laughs> That's a girl thing, no? Let me see that drawing. Hold on, masterpiece. Well, yeah. It's my... Oh shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it up. It might get your attention. Not taking a look at her picture? I didn't mean to. Stop. Don't touch it. It's your own. Yes, Sean. Mm, I get it. You want to keep the surprise. So can't wait to get out tonight. This week was hell. And I have to work at the store this weekend. You're still allowed to get wrecked at the party. No excuses. Leave me alone. Oh my God. Hold on, it. okay? You want to keep Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey! Look at my shirt, asshole! What's the big deal? It's Halloween! Uh, hey! Don't ever touch my brother! You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz! He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt! Look! I told you, it was an accident! You better leave us alone! Oh yeah, go hide in your dad's garage! Pussies! You think you own the block? Step back. He didn't mean it. He's a fucking kid. He's a fucking retard. What? What did you just say? You heard me, bitch. Don't ever touch him again. Or what? You're gonna get your daddy? Hey, asshole. I don't need him to protect me from you. Oh, you, you wanna go? Oh, yeah, <gasps> motherfucker? Then go back to your own country. <laughs> Whoa! Sean, you hit him! Get inside now! Sean! You're dead meat, bitch! <gasps> You and your whole fucking family are going to jail, losers! What? What's going Fuck on? me! Daniel, get over here! Sean, is he hurt? Okay, okay, step away. Now! Calm down, officer! Shut up! And step back! <laughs> on the ground! Now! Hey, wait! This guy was he started beating me. up my little brother. Now, hands behind your Sean. head. This is fucking bullshit. Oh no. Sean, what's Get happening? Off the ground, sir. Dad, we didn't do Sean, anything. Sean, be quiet. I swear. Officer, Sean, Sean listen. Oh. I'm sorry, Dad. Daddy, be quiet. want to go home. They're good kids, Officer. Don't move. I'm sure they didn't do I anything. Said don't move. Stop this. We didn't Daniel, do anything. It's going to be all right. On the ground.
anyone. Hey, come on. No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? Come on. But... But... My feet really hurt. These shoes suck. And we've been walking for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Yeah, so does mine. I was there too. Just knock it off. I hate it when you act like this. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being, being at home or, or in your room. This is a, a real adventure, right? So, come on, let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's Dad? Daniel, come on. We gotta go. Why isn't Dad with us, Sean? Doesn't he want to go camping too? Yes, but I told you that he can't. I told you. Okay? Okay. But I'm so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know. I know. Hey, at least we don't have to go to school on Monday, right? Yeah. Look, um, everybody's gonna be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Really? I bet Dad would be too. Do you think we walked, like, maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Feels like it. Ooh, awesome pots. But next time, Dad better give me a good pair of shoes, like yours. Dude, <laughs> Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Ow! We could be wolves. Yeah, yeah, that, that works. Just work on that how. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way without complaining once, huh? Uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I... I... Tag your ass and no. run! You're it! No way! Not fair! Whatever. Okay. I'm a zombie, and I'm gonna eat you! 
Stop. You know what? You're not allowed to say that. Ever again. Yes, sir. You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? I'm tired and hungry, too. Listen. This looks like a perfect place to camp out. I bet we're not the first people to stay the night. It's creepy. There's nobody out here. We didn't even see any cars. We're gonna camp here. I'll look out for you. Oh, look! Man, it's so A dirty. car out here? Hope the driver isn't around watching us. I see something. What is that? What do you find? Check it out. There's a chunky Choco Crisp bar on the dashboard. Yeah, I see it. You know I love Choco Crisp bars. I haven't had one in a million years. Yeah, right. More like two days ago. Come on. Can we please, please, please? Get one when we stop next, please. Let's take this one. Nobody's gonna miss one single Choco Chris bar. Really? I would. This is for a good cause. Oh, uh, almost. I got it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Boom. Choco Crisp is ours. Now we have dessert. Come on, let's beat it. Now we can see where we are. Cool. There's a river nearby. A river? Are we gonna go swimming? There must have been a big ass storm. Ooh, landslide. Doesn't sound good. I don't know, I guess they missed that car. What if the owners come after us for the Choco Chris? And they're hunters! You're too little to hunt. We're cool. Daniel! 
Check out this mark on the tree. What is that? Graffiti? Not exactly. It's called a trailblaze, and people used to put them up to give directions. Like GPS? <laughs> yeah, sure. Just slightly more ancient. Awesome! Let's follow it. If only Dad was here. Stop thinking about that. Get over yourself. I hope we don't get lost. Come on, Daniel. The sun is going down. <sighs> okay, dude. You have to use the bathroom? No. It smells real bad. No shit. Seriously? You better go now. I don't have to go. Jeez. Can I just pee on a tree? Okay, but you'll have to go on your own later. Stop treating me like a baby. Sean? Look how big these trees are. Eh, that's only because they need the sun. Besides, they'll protect us from the rain. What if they don't? What if they... Uh, attack us? Aren't you Mr. Minecraft? I thought you loved the forest. I watched you build giant cities out of logs. I did. I built the biggest cities ever. Ooh. I can use my axe to chop up some wood. Then we can build a secret base. <sighs> well, sounds like you're ready for the woods. Lead the way. Where are we going? Hmm. Huh. The river must be a bit further. Let's take a look around. Whoa. That place is huge. Yeah, it's kind of cool. <sighs> Ooh, Sean. Let's play hide and seek. Bet you can't find me. Oh, yeah? I'll give you 10 seconds to find a hiding spot, and then you're toast. Turn around so I can hide. And don't look. One, two... Come on! You're cheating! No peeking! Come on! You're cheating! No peeking! One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm coming. I can't tell him the truth now. I just can't. Now, where could Daniel be? Ooh, I see you, Daniel, but you don't see me. Aw, no fair. You were peeking. Not when I could see your foot a mile away, dude. I win. I win. Man, if I had a wooden axe. Oh, fuck. I have no idea where we are. What I'm doing.
Daniel, come check this out. What? What? Be quiet. He'll take off. Ooh, raccoon. He's so cute. <laughs> that raccoon will tear us apart. Let's go, bro. Here, kitty kitty. Here, kitty kitty. Aw, that raccoon must be starving. Raccoons are way smarter than us. What if the raccoon came with us? He could be our pet. Oh, man, raccoons are not a pet. You ever see their claws? Yeah, but this one likes me. Until you run out of food. Let it go, Daniel. Okay, now it's your turn. Hop on down. I'll catch you. How come nobody is out here? Huh? It's October. People don't hike as much. So why are we? Because we can. We're badass warriors, dude. Cool. Hey. Hey, Sean. Daniel. I found berries. You hear that? Can I taste one, please? Hold on. I'm coming. Is that a bird's nest? Oh, yeah. They're everywhere out here. At least they have a home. Come on. We're too big for a nest. High up. <clears throat> uh, Sean? Can you, uh... Come on. I got you. <clears throat> Phew. Thanks. Uh... You see that? Looks like a clicker. Creepy. Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. What the hell is that? Uh, I should have listened in biology class. We have to watch out for skeletons and zombies. Dude, you struck out. That did not scare me. Liar, liar! Uh, I saw your face. That was, uh, surprise. Maybe you scared me for like one second. <laughs> I got you, I eat you. Don't mess with the zombie. like a cave. Kind of, kind of spooky. No. Actually, it's kind of perfect. For what? For us, man. We're gonna stay in there? I don't know. Uh, come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. Hmm. We could fight off any skeletons or creepers with some good traps. Cool. In that case, we definitely need to get a fire going first, right? Right! Yes! Uh, so what do we need? Uh, you 
know, shit to make a fire. Um, twigs, branches. Are you sure we can do this? Who can stop us? Nobody. <sighs> okay. Let's unpack. Finally. Coming! Hey, Sean, let's have a race. Whoever finds three logs is the winner. Cool? Okay. You're brave to challenge me. So let's do it. No way you're gonna beat me. I wish Noah was out here with me. We could build a fort. Okay, Lazy. Go find some wood. Yes, here's no now this is perfect. Ooh, Daniel is in it to win it. Three! Nice and dry. That's enough for a toasty fire. I win! It's over, Sean. All right. How much you got? It's all there. Yeah, okay. That should be enough for the night. <laughs> See? Told you. I won. All right. We have a little time to explore before we light up the fire. Go check the river. Man, this place is like their own giant camp. We should catch some fish for dinner. Shit, those are bear claws. I'm not gonna tell Daniel. Fish, fish. Gotcha. Hmm. No, I don't. Feels good to focus on something after all that shit. I should take a good look at the subject before drawing. Stop moving so much. I think I'm ready to draw this. You catch every fish. Ooh! We can yell as much as we want! Drawing starts by observing. Like your teacher used to say. <sighs> I 
Okay. Got it. Time to take the pen, dude. He shoot. He Oh. Sorry. Dad gave me the sketchbook. He was so fucking awesome. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. I've looked enough. Time to draw now. This almost looks like a peaceful memory. Almost. I don't get it. I won't skip. me dude come on that's a boulder not a rock here you need a flat rock hold it like this look at my hand boom okay I did it my turn hold it with your thumb and finger and spin your wrist when you throw Don't worry, man. The current's just too strong here. We'll try on a lake next time. Deal? Deal. He thinks we're just going on a trip. I can't imagine when he'll find out what really happened. Oh, you want to challenge me? Behold my sword. The blade! On guard, Sir Daniel. But I'm fighting the tree, not you. The light will purge you. Uh, you're not fun, Sean. You know you're bigger than me. Not fair. Now that is a big web. <laughs> You're safe, little bro. Spiders hibernate in the fall. Good. I remember when you pushed me into that web. <sighs> hey, that was a long time ago. You got me back, right? Yeah, well, you screamed when you saw that plastic spider. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> yeah, ha ha. <laughs> At least they won't bug us tonight. <laughs> Get it? I ran into a web like that when I was a kid. Ew. We could build a really cool fort here again. Careful. Don't want to wake up covered in ants tomorrow. I'm digging the spot. Check this out, Sean. Whoa, nice view. You can see so far.
Wait, I'm coming. It's beautiful. Pretty amazing, huh? See? It's not so bad here in the forest. Hey, look at those clouds. What do they look like to you? I don't know. Cotton candy? That's it? Cotton candy? I don't know. What do you see? Andrew. Our babysitter? Where? I swear. Look. There's his gross ponytail. There's his pointy rat face. Oh no. It's so real. <sighs> Andrew sucked. I'm glad we don't need a babysitter anymore. Ooh, I see something else. There's a giant douchebag. <laughs> oh, yeah? Where? <laughs> right here. <laughs> right here, huh? <laughs> Let's go eat something. Me All right, and I know we're cave people now. Time to make fire. We make fire. Can I help? <sighs> you have a big mouth like me, so come on. Blow. Yes. Dude, don't blow it out. Sorry. Sorry. I wanted to do it like a movie. Oh, nice. It's warming up. Wish we had more. I know. Me too. Uh, I'm ready for dessert. <laughs> Go ahead. Mm, do you want a piece? Ah, uh, I'm good. You eat it. I'm the judge now. Not you. So you can't have a piece anyway. Okay. <laughs> Figures you try to get revenge, Judge. Hey, I want a new trial. Too late. Court closed. Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. So good. I wish we had a cheeseburger and a milkshake like yesterday. Dude, that shake was so good. Can't believe we found a diner on the way out here. 
I want another one. I know. We'll get you one. Promise. Nice, Sean. The ears are exactly what we needed for survival. Man, this is the coolest secret base ever. Nobody's gonna find us. I could really use a smoke. I am so over chips. Look, a full moon. Ooh! <laughs> it's not quite full yet, wolf boy. Do you think there are werewolves for real? <laughs> of course there are. But they're no match for us. How do you know? What if they come here? Oh! Bring it on! Sean? Come on. I'm kidding. We'll be safe here. You okay, buddy? Yeah. Feels good to sit down. Sean? Are you mad at me for what happened with Brett? I don't remember everything. It's not your fault. Shit happens. Brett deserved it. Why can't I remember? Ugh, that's weird. Um... Uh, don't worry, dude. You were running around all day. You tired out. It happens. So tired. This would. Uh, you look tired. Ready to crash? Uh, I think I need to go to the bathroom. I knew it. Okay, if you have to pee, then go. You want me to come? No, I'm not a baby. Dude, not that close. We have to sleep here. I wasn't. I was trying to find somewhere to go. Sean? I heard something. I swear. Yeah, it's a forest. There's a lot of critters out there. Scared you might pee on them? Shut up. I didn't. I think we earned some serious rest. I could sleep forever. Not on this ground. Ugh. Better than freezing out there, right? Way better. Now we have a real fire. And a secure base. You did awesome today, Daniel. Really? Hell yeah. Yeah, you're like a... a real wilderness expert. <sighs> That's cool. My eyes won't stay open, son. Sleep tight, bro.
dad. Dad, where are we? Daniel? Hey, bro, wake up. Huh? Sean? What happened? Where's dad? It's okay. You, you just had a bad dream. That's all. Sean? I'm scared. I keep hearing noises. Uh, no. No, don't be. Uh, everything's cool. But we're alone. You said there were bears and wolves. They're... They're sleeping. Like like we should be. And look. Our, our fire's still roaring. Daniel, we'll find a better place tomorrow, okay? And food, too. I promise. You promise? Promise. Look, it's easier now. We're going downhill. We just gotta keep walking. Yeah. You said things were getting better yesterday. And the day before. I'm sorry, dude. I'm trying my best. Let's walk a little more. There will be a rest stop or something where we can buy food. I'm sure of it. Are you okay? Yeah. No. I was just thinking about when Harry Thompson wanted to beat me up. Me and Noah traded some games with Harry. But he didn't like his, so he said he was gonna get us after school. What did you do? We waited in the gym until he went home. That's it? You should have told me. I tried. But you said to get out of your room. I'm sorry, you know, no. I should have listened. You did stand up for me, with Brett, for a change. Yeah, well, he had it coming. Yeah, I kind of wish you weren't so mean all the time. I'm trying my best, man. I know it's been tough. Don't worry. Hey, there's something ahead. <laughs> yep, must be the gas station we saw on that sign. Shit, my phone's dead. Finally! I thought we'd never get out of these woods alive. Awesome. I'm so hungry for real food right now. I hear you. We're gonna get food, water, and plus a map so we can find the best route. All right. 
Hey, come on. I know last night was tough, but... Oh, shit, they're still looking for us. We can't go back. Can't let Daniel know. Not right now. Um, maybe some other time. It's cool we found this place. there. Hey. Six down is a sharp one. Beware the Halloween blue sky. How the hell do I figure that out? Can't believe how lost we are. Thank God we found this place. See the baby bear, Daniel? That is awesome, possum. I mean, bear. So cool. Then he's all yours. We have a surplus, as you can tell. Really? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Whoa, Sean, they have Shaco Crisp. Oh, man. That is so Seven cool. Down. Go on. It's actually free. Cool. Thanks. It's a real nice map. You'll find lots of great hiking trails around here. Watch where you're walk. Hey, hi. Good evening. Yes, can I help you? You don't look like you're from around here. Uh, we're camping. Yeah? Where? I, I can't remember the name. It's not far. So where are your parents? Uh oh, we're with our friends. Pretty fun. By yourselves, all the way out here? Oh, it's no big deal. Um, just a short field trip. We're not that far from home. Well, didn't mean to grill you. Just making sure you're okay out here. Have a nice day. Weird to be in here after the forest. <sighs> like another world. Let's see. Ten across. New generation. What are you doing over there? Sean, what are you doing? Hi, what are you looking at? Oh, hey there. Well, I'm actually doing research. It's, uh... But not for you. Why? Like dirty stuff? Yuck. It's, uh... It's, it's going to be freezing to... Hey, hi. Uh, sorry about my brother. <laughs> oh, don't be. He's awesome. I know what you're thinking. What the hell is this creep looking at? Uh, no. I don't mean... I mean... It's not as weird as it seems, though. These people, they only want to live a normal life. Just naked. I mean, if they're not harming anyone, who's to say they're wrong? Nobody. Yeah, I agree. 
Yes, why should we all be the same? Who says so? <laughs> Never mind. I'm getting carried away. Name's Brody. I'm kind of an online traveling journalist. Sean. What's a online traveling journalist? Just a fancy name for someone who drives around in a car, writing about people and stuff. There's a few websites that pay me for these papers since I know how to write. Nice to meet you, man. You traveling with your brother? Yeah, we're on the road, going south. Good for you. The best way to learn is on the road. The earlier, the better. Well, I'd love to talk and avoid work all day, but I'm already up against the deadline. Safe travels, dudes. Thanks, man. See you around. At least it's got a lot of sugar. Keep our energy up. Um, what's that? Looks like you're all set to go. Is that it? Yeah, I think so. Okie dokie. Let's ring you up. And there's the damage. There you go. Thanks much. All right, here's your change. Cool. Thanks. Never thought I'd be so excited to see a gas station. Boring. I'm Daniel. So what exactly are you doing all the way out here? It's a secret adventure. Is that so? That's so, way too expensive. Did you make all these bears? Oh no, I won't take any credit for the bears. That's all I'm- Hey, don't bother her. Sorry about that. But, uh, I'm talking to her. He sure likes to chat. Yeah, he talks a lot. <sighs> Whatever. I do not talk too much. <sighs> you always say that. But that's not true. Is she laughing? She's staring at you. Oh my god, this is the coolest thing ever. Hey, come here. Check it. Wow, did something interesting happen here? Like an extra coin? <laughs> of course yeah. they do. We're not from around here. Get over it. Might on Papa Road Cred. Power Bear is amazing. I want to put this in my room. Sorry, dude. Go, Power Bear. You'd had to drag my ass to make me come back here after all this. Hey, check out the puppy.
Yeah, it's a dog. It's a puppy! Super cute! <laughs> yeah, super cute. Is this yours? No, just another stray mutt. Aww, he must be sad. What's his name? That's a she. Oh, right. Oh, can we have the puppy? Please? <sighs> Let me think. I don't know. It's a pretty huge responsibility. Yeah. It would be so cool. Come on. We need adults to take care of her, not kids. I know. I just thought we could. I'd love to. She's right. We can't take care of a dog right now. Do monsters drink beer? Hey look, empty table. Oh, let's grab it and check out this map. We could eat. Yay, a fucking half-eaten apple. It's our table now. <laughs> yep. Let's see. What do we got here? Huh. Is that all we've got? Sorry, you know. Better than nothing, right? Where are you guys off to now? Uh, south, I guess. Right on. Pro tip, don't feed the bears. <laughs> See you later. Whoa, that's a big map. <sighs> yeah, hope I can read it. to be Washington? I don't recognize anything. Yeah, me neither. But we have to be somewhere in there. Hey, I know. We're here. There's a gas station. See? Nah, no way. We were near Mount Rainier yesterday, but it's miles away now. Let me show you where we are, okay? Yeah, okay. We slept at that trout trail thing. Then we walked south for a while. All right, this is it. Are you sure? <gasps> yes, it is. It's next to the river we camped by yesterday. Here we are. Okay, so can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? Oh, but it looks cool. Hold on, I'll find where we can go. Hey kids, looks like you're out camping. Oh, yeah. Just going over trails and stuff. 
Seems dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watched. Huh? What do you mean? We sure just... hope you pay for all that. We don't tolerate shoplifters. Uh... Sir, we paid for this. And the map was free. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you bought. Uh, no, thanks. We have to go. Nope. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Or I will. No, you won't! Don't try it, punk. Sean... We didn't do anything, man! Leave us alone! Ooh. you might be interested in. Oh, they ain't going anywhere. Don't you worry. Okay, fine. Thank you. What the fuck? Where am I? Oh, shit. Daniel. No, no, no. Don't do this to me. Straightened out. I'm not sure about this, Hank. I don't know. And they'll be off our property and won't be our problem no more. If you say so, then. Well, I'll let you deal with it. Oh, hey there. You finally awake? Sorry I had to secure you. But if you're innocent, don't act guilty. How's your stomach? I'm gonna tell the police you kidnapped me. Nice try. But I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. I saw it in the paper. Maybe I should call ICE to make sure you're a citizen. Fuck you, hillbilly. I'm American. Mm. Uh, shut up, thief. You're on my land, and I didn't ask you to come rip me off. You're lucky my wife didn't catch you. She's the gun collector in our family. Whatever. You're going to jail for this. Pretty sure the local police will vouch for me over a thug like you. Where's my brother? Wish I knew. Little shit took off. I'll find him. Don't worry. If you touch him... You think I'd hurt a little boy? Guess you didn't have any second thoughts about leading him out in the middle of nowhere, though. That's real safe for a little kid. If he's lucky, he won't end up like his criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason we need to build that wall. You hold tight. I'm gonna go get your brother. Be scared shitless. I can't leave him out there. Wonder if I could get more light from it. That's a little better. 
I'm sorry, but you married an asshole. Daniel? I'm right here. Are, are you okay? I, I, I think so. That old guy chased me into the woods, but I, I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. <laughs> hey, Emmanuel, you're doing great. You totally fooled them. Thanks to you, we have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. He called the cops on us. Think, dude. There's gotta be a way out of here. Hey, you think you can open the back door? Why did I... It won't open. It's locked. What do I do? I don't know. Let me think. There's a window over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. It is, but be careful, it might attract him. I don't even want to think- Oh yeah, this racist shithead is a real pillar of the community, all right. Can you try and open this vent? We'll figure something out. Sean, is everything all right? Yeah. Don't worry. I'm almost there. Hey, the old guy's gone. M maybe you can enter from the store door. Come on, Sean. We gotta hurry. Before the bl oh, shit. Okay. Sean? What's going on? I'm trying to get the hell out of here. I almost got it, bro. Just hold on. Of course the fucking keys are all the way over there. What now? Right. I need something to break this shit. Okay, Daniel. I see some keys, but I can't reach them. <sighs> Maybe I can... Get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. Find me something sturdy, like a, a screwdriver or a wrench, anything. But where can I find one? Enano, I can't really see much from where I am. There should be some tools nearby. Stop freaking yourself out, dumbass. Sean? Take a breath. I found something. Okay. Is this what you wanted? This is it! You rule, Daniel. Sean. I'm 
really scared. Come on. Let's do this. Yes! Good job, bro. Come on, you mother! Yes! Score! Did you do it? Here, here. Come on. Okay, hold on. Come on. Yes! Sean! Oh, God, I was so scared. What happened to your face? That old bastard happened. Okay, we need to cut this off, fast. How about these? Dude, you're Brock. Did that asshole see you? No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay. Now we gotta get my stuff and go. Daniel, what? What happened? What? What did you do? I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's okay. You're safe now. You fucking little spick. You and your brother are going to jail for the rest of your life. The hell with you. I told you to leave us alone. Sean, what are you doing? Daniel, come on. We gotta get out of here. Come on! Come on! Wait! Shit! Where are we going? Sean! Watch out! Over there! Let's go! I don't know! What are you doing out here, man? You almost scared the shit out of me. You guys okay? Look at that asshole at the gas station. You're fucking crazy. He tied me up in his back office. I swear. Dude, say no more. I believe you. Okay. She's crazy out in the woods. Get in, you too. Hurry up before he catches us.
was crazy. <laughs> and I thought I was having a shitty day. I knew that guy was sketchy. He was a total fucking dickhead. Man, it felt good to beat his ass. Whoa, kid. Maybe he deserved it, but don't do it and don't talk about it. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> Sorry. I'm just still pissed off. Welcome to Redneck Land. The Saint Seattle no more. We only lived in one place my whole life. Kinda lame, but... Well, you're pretty young. You have time. That's what's great about traveling. It gives you perspective. Sometimes maybe too much. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <coughs> What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. Daniel. What? We saved her. <laughs> We're heroes. Are you kidding me? We can't keep a dog. But you said that maybe we could. <laughs> Don't give up, Daniel. He's on the ropes. Jeez, come on. We need a dog. Bet Dad would agree. <sighs> just, just stop. <sighs> You win, but you better really take care of her. Deal. Thanks, Sean. She's gonna be so quiet, and... and... and what should we name her? Hey, your dog, your choice. Oh, cool! Let's see. Um... Mm, how about... Uh, mushroom. She totally looks like a mushroom. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Not much of a girl's name, though. Who cares? I'm sure she loves it. So do I. <laughs> All right. Mushroom it is, then. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Thanks, big brother. See, Mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> mushroom. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dudes. <laughs> so, what do you do exactly? Long, boring story short, I come from a family with money, but no soul. I took off after school and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protests, try to make some positive change. Whatever. Wow. So you're like all political. Everything is political, Sean. Are you, like, famous or something? <laughs> More like, or something. People in my network know who I am and vice versa. Well, that's enough for me. <laughs> Sounds pretty awesome. <laughs> I kind of wish I was famous, too. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah, and feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh, yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious. Look at that. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I... I don't even know what happened. It was so fast. It was the police. It's their fault. Dano just wanted to play zombie outside. Our shithead neighbor was picking on him. I got in a fight, so Dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops and, and they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive, then... <laughs> fucking cops. <laughs> hey, it's gonna be all right. Take a deep breath. Listen, I'm really sorry this happened to you, man. Injustice is everywhere. And you're taking the brunt of it right now. But you're gonna be okay, Sean. How? Wish I could go back to my town. Even if it was boring like that one. At least I've had friends. Family. A home. I used to bitch about it so much. Now I've got... Nothing. What is sure is, that's the past. You can't look back now. 
You've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but what you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean, at some point, you're gonna have to tell him. I know. I just have to find the right time. Take it from me. The sooner you can address it, the better. Yeah. I'm gonna do it next chance I get. It's just... It's not gonna be easy. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? Good question. I was thinking... Get out of the country? Fuck it. Go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn. I thought I was the long-haul traveler. <sighs> Should I go back? To Seattle? Maybe I can try and explain everything. What happened? You should do what you think is best. If going to Mexico seems like the right thing to do, then so be it. You're going in the right direction. You have family there? Maybe. We don't even have family in the U.S. Except for grandparents we don't see anymore. What about your mom? No, no way. She's... out of the picture. But Dad, he always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Los. That's a pretty cool name. So it's gotta be great. Okay, so you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. I'll drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. Okay, Mushroom, you can chase me. Then, Sean. <laughs> um, no. Come, see if you can catch me. Ow! <laughs> Too bad sandcastles never last. Glad to see him act like a kid again. How will I tell him? Hey! Let's play fetch with the pup! Really? Yes! Let me do a test throw first. Cool? Well, okay. But I'm next. Okay, puppy. Go wide. Come on, Mushroom. Get it. Go, Mushroom. <laughs> Good doggy. I think we need a Frisbee. 
Whoa, what did you find? You just killed a shark! <laughs> you deadly mushroom. She's awesome! Now she wants me to throw the stick. Okay, here. <laughs> Watch how fast she'll get the stick. You go for it. Just don't throw it too far. I won't. I swear. I mean, I promise. Come on, mushroom. Come on. Look, it's a stick. Fetch! Get that stick! Looks like these two are getting along. It's good to see him like that. Well, I got you that room. Seriously? I... It's only a room. No big deal. Look, I had tough times when I started out. And some strangers saved my life. Thank you. Now's my turn to help someone. It's right there, room 10. On the second floor. Listen, I don't want to freak you out, okay, but you have to be twice as careful now. I know it's easier said than done, but you should get rid of that phone. Really? You can always get a burner later. Trust me. And Sean, talk to Daniel. He deserves Brody. to... You're not leaving, are you? Yes, I am, but not until Santa Brody gives you a goodbye gift. Ta-da! I, I mean, ho, ho, ho. And don't you dare argue about it. I'll leave it right here if you do. Okay, you win. Thanks, Brody. Feels good. Here, looks like it's yours now. As always. <laughs> Hold on. I didn't forget you. I've had it since my first road trip. And it's always kept me safe. Now it's yours. Cool. Um, do you think it's okay if she wears it? Like, our official dart dot? <laughs> sure. It's your bandana now. Okay, time for me to hit the road again. Hey, don't look so sad. You can contact me on my blog, A Tribe Called West. So, you better keep me posted when you can, okay? We will. Thanks again, Brody. <laughs> ah, bro hug. you could stay with us. Me too, kid. <sighs> Sorry, I'll probably think of a better goodbye when I'm on the road, but until then, take care, my dudes. I'm gonna miss him. Me too. Okay. Time to hit the sack. Don't worry, Mushroom. I got you. Okay. Good. Looks like the manager's asleep for the night. Shouldn't have any trouble from them. think it will have Netflix or a jacuzzi? Dude, this is some hotel, not an Airbnb. If we're lucky, it'll have cable and a hot shower. Ooh, 
Ooh. Check it out. It even has a bathtub. <laughs> Good. I'm gonna throw you in, cave boy. We can watch TV, too. And there's a balcony. Whoa, this is nice. And warm. <sighs> this bed is soft. What about this one? Uh, not bad. But too far from the TV. Can I take the one in front of the TV? Huh? Wanna play it over rock, paper, scissors? Oh, there's no way you can beat me, but ready? I am so ready to beat you. Aw, shoot. I told you, man. Can we play another round? Come on. Sure, I mean, you're gonna lose again, but suit yourself. Not this time. Oh, Ty. Aw, oh, come on. I won! <laughs> the pet is mine! I knew I'd beat you. See? And I knew you'd brag about it. Don't be salty. It's a fair win. Yeah, it is. I surrender. All right, I'm gonna run a bath. We totally reek. Especially you, Pidpen. I wouldn't be so sure, Cave Boy. I'll call you when it's ready. Uh, I'll be right here. Of course you will. Oh, cool. Hot Dog Man is on. Oh, I remember this episode. Weird, it's on so late. Fill her up. Ugh, yuck, Sean. There's a condom in my bag. Gross. Hey, don't touch that. This episode is awesome. You should sit down and watch it with me. Let's put this in the bathroom for Prince Daniel. <sighs> Daniel, you have towels in the bathroom. Don't forget to use yeah, them. Yeah. Daniel will love this. Mushroom, look! It's Hot Dog Man! Hey, Daniel. Bath's ready. What? Already? Can I finish this episode first? <laughs> no, man. You smell so bad, there's no time to lose. Hey, you smell too. Oh my god. Whoa. So many bubbles. Try and keep them in the bathtub. I will. Promise. Thanks. And no, the dog is not taking a bath with you. Okay, okay. Don't worry. I should throw my phone away while Daniel is washing. He'd freak out if he saw me. Time to say goodbye to modern life.
Lila's freaking out. Maybe I should leave her out of this, or she'll get into trouble too. Hey, Lyle. Sean, is that you? Do you... Sean! Oh, God. Are you okay? I guess. I'm... I'm in a motel. With Daniel. <laughs> Shit! Everyone's looking for you here. Fuck. I didn't do anything. I know. God, this is so messed up. The cops are talking to everybody at school. This is a nightmare. We're fucked. Sean, don't say that. It will be okay. I miss you so much. Maybe you could come back. You know I wish I could, but we can't take that risk. They're, they're gonna put me in juvie. Daniel! Bullshit. You're innocent. And I've got your back. No matter what. No way. I'm not gonna let you get in trouble for me. Stop acting like I'm never gonna see you again. That's bullshit. I'm sorry. I totally hate this. I guess... the freaking fighters are disbanded for a while. Shit actually changes, I guess. So, where are you going? Um, we're just going away for now. I'll call you if I get a chance. I miss you, Lila. Sean, wait. Okay. 
Don't think about it. Just tell Daniel the truth. Are you kidding me? Remember that song? Come on, dance! Man, I, I can't dance right now. My legs are thrashed. Sorry. You're no fun. Daniel, uh, come here. We need to talk. Can we get a drink first? I'm thirsty. Right now? You said I could have a Coke. Or something. Okay, I'll get you a soda. But when I come back, we're going to talk. Serious. Fine. What's the big deal? It's gonna be so hard to talk with Daniel. Let's go get the soda first. Sorry. I just... Just don't lie to me ever again. Ever. I promise I won't lie to you again. I promise. I'm serious, Sean. I know. Me too, Danny. <laughs> what are we gonna do without him? Shh. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Nothing is wrong with you. You're... different. Okay. What are we gonna do now? I was thinking... maybe we could go to Puerto Lobos. Where Dad grew up, you know? 
Yeah, I guess. It'll be fine, Daniel. There's nothing we can't do. As long as we're together. Can you tell me a story? Like he did? I'm not as good as him. <laughs> he used to tell me bedtime stories too. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home there with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together.
All right. Come on, man. Focus. Okay. Trust me. You can do it. <laughs>